Hello everyone, welcome back to your Patshala. Today's editorial that is on the 13th of September 2021 is as follows. A Patel at the helm. And if you notice uh, the presentation of mine uh, keenly, you can find uh, some words that are highlighted. And please make a note of these words as you are going to get these words directly in your exam. Change of guard. Change of guard is uh, the change of position or the change uh, of uh, you know uh, the power from one place to the other and came out of the blue and here you got an idiom uh, to be noted uh, came out of the blue is uh, something that is shocking or surprising in nature intrigue when considered as a noun uh, it is uh, a secret plot under the wraps if something is kept as a secret it is under the wraps for example i can say uh, i am doing the work under the wraps that means uh, you are i am doing the work secretly or clandestinely is on the cards for instance uh, a movie uh, by naga chaitanya and uh, sai pallavi that is a love story is on the cards the release is on the cards is on the cards is possibly or likely cozy relations or pleasant relations uh, starkly starkly is an adverb uh, since we added ly to an adjective stark is an adjective here and starkly happens to be an adverb here okay and starkly uh, is uh, something that we do uh, in a harsh manner and looming looming is uh, emerging and restive uh, a lot of people confuse between restive and restless restless is uh, being insomniac and restive is uh, being crazy or uh, hulky kind of thing and viable is functional rudderless is baseless underscores if i stress on something if i emphasize something that is underscoring so whenever you say i underscore or uh, she or he underscores it means he or she uh, stresses or emphasizes something and trench the trench is uh, uh, you know uh, an underground tunnel uh, that is usually built by uh, soldiers or warmen so if i say entrench that is deeply rooted and at the helm where do we keep helmet we keep helmet here on the head right so at the helm means the captaincy or in the position or the control so the return of uh, a patel uh, at the helm at the helm means in control indicates a reversal of the bjp strategy if you look at these two lines properly you can uh, interpret you know the uh, meaning of the uh, given idiom here and uh, a partial ejection of patels to accommodate a wider range of caste groups in its tent was the bjp approach under mr modi and amit shah so what's the gist of this passage let me not waste your time actually uh, let me uh, you know bring out the gist of this editorial a patel at the helm a patel in charge recently in gujarat vijay rupani was replaced with bhupendra patel who is Vijay Rupani and who is Bhupendra Patel? Ever since our Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi came into power, he promised all the minority sections and backward classes that they would be brought to power or they would be brought to, you know, control the people. But the reverse has happened. Now, Bhupendra Patel, uh, who belongs to a Patidar community, a majority community in Gujarat, has been given the power to reign or the power to control. So what BJP captain promised was all the backward communities will be given the chance to control the state. But what happened here, since Bhupendra Patel belongs to Patidar community, he is not of uh, the minority caste. He is of, uh, you know, an upper ca caste kind of, uh, you know, uh, uh, citizen. So what happened now, there is a strife or there is a fight between these two communities and as well as two parties here. So what are the two parties here, Congress and the BJP? And if you look at the uh, statements here, a partial ejection of Patel's, ejection of Patel's to accommodate a wider range of caste groups. Here, if you read in between the lines, a partial ejection of Patel's or Patidars to accommodate a wider range of caste groups. That means a wider range of minority caste groups in its tent towards the BJP approach under Mr. Modi and Amit Shah. And their national strategy mirrored this Gujarat experiment. But this experiment failed since uh, Bhupendra Patel is not from a, a minority community. He is of Patidar community. 80% of Gujarat is of Patidar community. So the Patels in turn rebelled or fought against the Modisha axis 
several times in the last two decades. Okay, Mr. Rupani was less than impressive in administrative tasks or management of the social coalition or union. The COVID-19 pandemic exposed his failures starkly. Or the COVID-19 pandemic exposed Vijay Rupani's failure you know, in a harsh manner. So the people or the Patel community, the people of Patel community have become more restive, have become crazy enough to fight with the BJP. So what happened now? Ultimately, Bhupendra Patel has been brought back. And here, if you read the supplements properly, the BJP is once again willing to accommodate dominant caste groups, but it is not that easy. Uh, let me come to the last few lines here. The BJP is partially acting under pressure, but it may also be feeling more confident of the support of the marginal communities and poorer sections to accommodate its traditional supporters. So the gist of the entire uh, editorial is, uh, you know, what the BJP promised and what is happening right now in Gujarat or the entire country in total.